Hi, so what you see right now is the stock fan of the AMD FX 8320 and I am going to replace that stock fan with this Coolmaster Hyper T4 and after I do that I will show you the after and as you can see already that it is nearly four times the size of the stock fan here and the difference is this is going to be mounted vertically while you'll notice the stock fan is mounted horizontally. So um, once again, uh, just give me a couple seconds and I will show you the, the uh, Hyper T4 in my AMD 8320 here, which is an 8-core AMD CPU. And uh, I hope this works. Hi, so this is the after I've installed the Coolmaster T4 and it took about just a couple of minutes, like two minutes. And this is the stock fan, as you can see. Um, let me actually zoom in closer so you could get a better look of how it looks in, in a tower case here. So as you can see, that the clip itself, I didn't have to remove the motherboard, which was my main concern. Didn't have to remove the motherboard and also did not have to replace the mounting bracket. And there you go, that is the Hyper T4. I just to give you a better idea of how the Hyper T4 fits into a case here. So this is my Hyper T4 Coolmaster. And once again, I didn't have to remove any mounting brackets or remove the motherboard to install the mounting bracket. It was simply a clip-on for my AMD FX8320. And as you can see here, I have an AM3 Plus motherboard. And this was the original fan, the original AMD FX 8320 stock fan and I guess we'll see we'll see how this works out hopefully the noise level of the fan itself would be very quiet because it was just driving me nuts how how loud the stock fan has gotten over three years let's zoom in here so you can see you could see the bottom there it says AM 3 plus which is the type of motherboard that I have here. But there you go. That's really it, and uh, thank you for watching.